yes, sir. Yes, sir. poison. Nice yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We are investigating HMS Cavalier, a World War II destroyer ship built in 1944, which was the fastest ship in the fleet. HMS Cavalier was decommissioned in 1972 and has remained here at Chatham Dockyards ever since. Cavalier is also a memorial to over 11,000 lives that were lost on destroyer ships throughout the Second World War. We are the first paranormal team to be granted access to the ship. There have been reports of loud noises, footsteps, voices and shadow figures as if the ship is still in operation with its crew on board. And this seems to be the case with the evidence that we have captured so far. Beautiful ship. Is it possible that you can do something, please? To let me know that you're here. Okay. Right down the bottom of the hallway. Something moved. I actually thought the door was going to open. Have you got a name, sailor? Thank you. 
I am alone on the lower deck in one of the passageways. So far, I've heard which sounded like the opening of a door, and now something else was to approach me. Well, here I am at the uh, front of the ship. Uh, it's absolutely baking down here. It's been 27 degrees outside. So you can imagine what it's like being in here. So you're probably wondering what I'm doing here, standing in the dark. I've come to speak to the crew of the HMS Cavalier. Now, this has never been done before. No one's come here to speak to you. So we have this evening, because we'd like to know your story. Now there's several devices that I've placed here just on the floor there, there's a flashing box. And it's a type of REM pod. And what that is, is it's got flashing lights on it and it gives off an EMF bubble. And if you touch it or go near it, it will make an alarm. It will let me know that you're here. And also on the floor, there's a device called an EMF tripwire. Again, if you go near it, it will change colour, just to let me know that you are here. And right down the far end, there is a sensitive digital recorder. Now, you may not know what a digital recorder is. It's the same as what I'm holding in my hand. And what that does, that records your voice, records sounds. So if you speak into the red light of this that I'm holding in my hand, or the one at the bottom of the hallway, we can play it back and hear what you have to say. So, first of all, can I say that we all thank you for what you did during the war? Thank you for saving this country and lots of lives. And also that we remember the ones that didn't make it, that didn't come home. And we thank them too. So if any of you can hear me, hear my voice, is it possible that you can do something please? To let me know that you're here. Okay, right down the bottom of the hallway, something moved. I actually thought the door was going to open. Okay, right down the bottom of the hallway, something moved. I actually thought the door was going to open. Please, shout out your name and then I can look in the records and see who you were and what you did on this ship. If you can't speak, 
If you don't have the energy to speak, can you close one of the doors or bang on a door, please? Just so I know that you're at least listening to me. Or if you can just touch that device in the doorway. That would be absolutely fantastic. Whoa, wow. That was footsteps walking towards me. Footsteps can be heard coming from the end of the passageway walking towards me. Here is the audio enhanced taken from my digital recorder. Whoa, wow. That was footsteps walking towards me. Are you a private? What rank are you, please? Something's definitely moving back here. Hello, who's there? Please come and join me. Someone back there? Something's definitely moving back here. Something's definitely moving back here. All fell silent and nothing more was heard. So I ended my session making way for Mark to go to the accommodation quarters at the rear of the ship. I don't know if you know already, but as I say, my name's Mark. I've come a long way to visit this beautiful boat, and it was a surprise to us. And boy, was it a surprise. Do you mind me being on here and down here in the mess room? Noises from in there. 
Are you in the next room? Could you come in here, please, and make a noise? I come out of respect. I keep thinking something's going to walk out of that door there because I'm hearing noises over there. So that's why I keep looking. What was your position on this boat when it was in service? It's like tapping coming from somewhere. Could you maybe not back for me? I just got a real strange feeling then on the top of my head, like tingling. Shit. Real loud tapping coming from in there. That seems to be quite quite prominent in there and it's good because there's nobody in there and there's a static night vision camera set up and it's totally empty in there It's been a really, really hot day today and it's still boiling on the boat. Um, even though I'm on a lower deck, it's still really warm in here. Do you think you could make, make me go cold? Ah. Feels like something's touching my hand. Is that you touching my hand? Could you do it again, please? It felt all... It felt all like static electricity. Could you do it again? Well... Now I've gone cold. I did ask for it. Who's with me? It's all static around this area. I can like put my arm, my arm into it. Are you stood near me? Oh my God. I thought I saw something in that doorway then when I heard that really loud tap. I thought I saw something looking round that doorway then. Now I'm not 100% sure of that, but as I heard the tap and looked round, I thought I saw something in that doorway, but in that room. Did I just see you? Make that noise again, please. Mark leaves the rear of HMS Cavalier and we all meet up outside to prepare for the final part of the investigation. In this doorway here, there is a music box. And if you wave your hand in front of it or go up to it, it will play a tune. And also next to it is a recorder, again with a red light on it. And if you want to say anything, leave a message, then please speak into the red light and we can play it back and hear what you have to say. So can I ask that 
when you was here on the ship travelling around the world? Did many people die? How many people did you lose in battle? My name's Jeff, the gentleman over there, that's Mark, and the lady over this side, that's Becky. What's your name, please? Now, just so that you do understand, that we've been given permission to be here on your ship. We're just here to speak to you, to find out who you are and what it was like serving on the HMS Cavalier. So is it possible that you can come and join us please? Can you close the door, move something, bang on something? Well, oh, there was something there. Hello? Was that you making a noise? Can you make another noise please? Come into this room and join us. Can you tell us your rank, name and number please? See that strip of light there? By that, by that wind, I've just seen that black out. Oh, it's freezing. It's freezing, Jeff. Hey. Mm -hmm. Someone's just sat down. Mm -hmm. Someone's just sat down on the end. Over there. You could hear the seat creaking. Mm -hmm. And it went freezing cold on my route as well. And I saw someone pass that light just before Becky said she went cold. Hi there. Hello, sir. My name's Private Jeff. And there's Private Mark and Private Becky. What's your name, please? I'm just going to sit down here. Shadows right over there on you know that silver that square silver that's where thing? I'm noises from. Oh, yeah. yeah big shadows moving from left to right 
and back again. Are you getting that, Mark? I don't know. I think I'm right. They've stopped. Think, yeah. yeah, they stopped. That's, it was a minute ago. That's where I'm hearing noises from now. Yeah. Mark and Becky are seeing movement from nearby and Becky captures a shadow figure on her camera. Here is the footage again followed by the footage enhanced. Shadows right over there. On, you know that silver, that square silver That's where I'm thing. Noises from. Yeah. Oh, yeah, big shadows moving from left to right and back again. Are you getting that, Mark? I don't know. I think I might. Have got they stopped. Yeah, they stopped. That's, it was a minute ago. That's where I'm hearing noises from. Down yeah. There. Shadows right over there on you know that silver that square silver That's where I'm thing. Noises from. Oh, yeah. yeah big shadows moving from left to right and back again are you getting that Mark I don't know I think I might have got they stopped yeah they stopped That's, it was a minute ago That's where I'm hearing noises from down yeah. there. We complete our investigation on HMS Cavalier and with the evidence that we have documented there seems to be some of the crew still on board. We would like to thank all those involved who made this investigation possible and we dedicate this episode to all of those 11,000 plus naval officers who lost their lives serving on board the World War II destroyers throughout the war.